Hi there, thanks so much for joining me today. Today I'll be showing you how I made a laptop case out of an old blanket. You may recognize this blanket from my blanket jacket video I made earlier this year. I'll link that here if you missed it. First I measured my laptop, which is about 12 by 9 inches. I added an inch to my measurements to account for seam allowance and I cut two pieces out. I then cut a piece for the zippered pouch and for the top flap. These pieces both measured 6.5 by 10 inches. For the flat piece, I folded it in half and cut a bit of a curve. I needed some binding for the raw edges of the laptop case. I didn't have any binding left over from the original blanket, so I had to make my own. I did this by cutting a long strip an inch and a half thick. I then ripped out all the threads, which left me with two long strips of each color. I used a lint roller to take out all of the loose threads. I then finished the binding by folding and ironing the piece in half, unfolding it, and folding both of the sides to the middle and ironing. I repeated this for the other piece of tape. I'm going to use this for the interior of the laptop bag later. I pinned the binding to the curved edge of the flap and to the top of the zippered pouch. Ignore this other piece, it was a piece I had cut out but didn't end up using for this project. I sewed the binding on, making sure that I got all the layers together. I marked out where I wanted the buttonhole to be on the flap and made my buttonhole using the zigzag stitch setting on my machine. To add the zipper, I first lined up the pouch and flipped the zipper over so that the right side of it was facing the right side of the main fabric. I took the pouch away for now and pinned the side of the zipper closest to the bottom of the fabric. I sewed the zipper on using my zipper foot. I then sewed another row of stitches on the edge of the zipper to keep it from getting in the way. I folded my main fabric in half so that the zipper was facing right side up. I then took the pouch piece and lined it up with the other side of the zipper and pinned and sewed it together. Now I flipped the pouch piece so that it was together with the main fabric and pinned this in place. There's a slight gap where the zipper ends so I made sure to pin this as well and sew it. My seam allowance was 3 eighths of an inch.
Now the laptop case has a cute zipper pouch. The next step is to pin the back and the front of the case right sides together and sew, leaving the top of the case open. I then pinned and sewed the binding that I made earlier to the raw edges of the case, again excluding the top. I cut the excess tape and flipped the case right side out. I then pinned the flap to the back of the case right sides together and sewed it on. I added a last piece of binding to the opening of the case to finish off the raw edges. I ended up switching my button out with this cute button that I found. I thought it matched the case a lot better. I sewed this on and seam ripped the buttonhole open. And the case is finished. I really love how it turned out and it's so great to be able to use more of this old blanket for projects like this. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, I'd love it if you gave it a thumbs up and if you want to see more DIY videos like this, then hit the subscribe button. Bye for now!